right there it's kind of evenly just nicking all the way down on parallel. Now what I'm going to do is turn it on and then I'm going to grind. And you're just going to grind until you get it to grind evenly all the way across and you'll be done. Once you're done, if it's a used bed knife, you would rotate this up straight up, measure the angle, measure the angle, tilt it back five degrees, and you would cut the top face to meet the width that the book calls for, the tech manual calls for, and has the right angle. And so it's kind of time consuming because you just have to play with it quite a bit. You're going to stick the real blade in here, you clamp it, and instead of the head itself traversing back and forth, this one here, the tray traverses back and forth. I'll take my angle finder, I measure the angle of my, my bed knife. This stone, since it's actually fixed on here solid, will always be 90. So I'm going to find 90, and then I'm going to tilt it back or forwards to get my relief, my desired relief. So if I want my desired relief to be 5 degrees, I'm going to tilt it back or tilt it forward. Once I, re I achieve it, I tighten it down. There's a knob right here that tells that parallels me forward. This one here goes up and down. So I go forward and back and up and down. When I do the same thing I did over there, bring the bed knife back and forth until it just touches. I'm going to turn this on and I'm going to grind it. When I'm done, I'm going to rotate it. Stand it up 90 degrees. Use my angle finder. Find out if I'm at 90. Same thing, I can actually move this in and out. So if I tilted this back, I can move this stone over here and it's going to be for, further forward and I would grind it. But again, it's fully, fully hand operated. You have to physically run it back and forth. The ideal peerless that we've seen on the film, that one there had two heads. It actually cut the top face and the bottom face at the exact same time. And so setup on that one was very simple and fast. You put it in, you clamp it down, they're real easy to adjust. It holds it very firm. You just check real quick to see if it's parallel by running the stone against the front of the face. As soon as it barely touches, you turn it on, start grinding. Got two stones or got a crease in it? It's actually got two. It's got one motor with a stone and one motor with a stone. So it cuts the front face and this stone actually cuts the top face. So it's actually doing two operations at once. It automatically traverses back and forth. So you physically don't have to move it. That's kind of handy. It has mist cooling, so your bed knife's not going to get hot. You're not going to cause it to expand and warp. And it's fast.